Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll show you a quick way to check if your Windows user account has administrator privileges. Knowing this is important because administrator privileges determine your ability to install programs, change system settings, troubleshoot problems, or perform tasks that affect other users. And if you don't have administrator privileges when you need them, you'll see an access denied error message. And the easiest way to check if your account has administrator privileges is through settings. Open Windows 11 settings. Then click on the accounts section in the left sidebar, which will open your account information and sign in options. On the top right side of the accounts page, you'll find your account name and below it, the account type. If it's administrator, your account has administrator privileges. And if it's standard user, your account doesn't have administrator privileges. Even if you're signed in with a Microsoft account, the same label will appear. This is the simplest way to visually verify your account. And it works effectively on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. Although this method is easy, there is another easy way to find out your account type on Windows 11 using the command prompt. By executing a single command, you can find out your account type on Windows 11. Open the command prompt window, then enter the command whoami slash groups to view the group membership of the logged in user. Once you run the command, it will display all the security groups to which your account belongs whether local or domain groups, as well as the attributes of each group. Review the results or command output if you see a line containing built-in administrators or simply administrators, depending on the format. Your account is a member of the local administrators group, which means your account has administrator privileges. If there is no entry for administrators or built-in administrators, your account is not a local administrator. Of course, if you're a member of the administrators group, that means your account has administrator privileges. That's all in today's video. In any way you can find out your Windows account type. If you found this video helpful, please like the video, subscribe to my channel, and activate the bell button so you don't miss the next video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.